guys, it's Fiskun here today with a Windows tutorial using the command prompt and 7-zip. I'm going to try and do it in under three minutes. The goal here is to take this picture, 01, and combine it with hidden.zip so that you don't know the zips inside. First thing we're going to do is open the command prompt. From there, we're going to find the desktop. So in this case, we're going to type cd backslash users backslash your name backslash desktop. We're now in the desktop. The next step is to type in as follows, copy back uh, for, forward slash B quotation, the name of the file you want. So mine will be 01 ping PNG. I know there's no I in there, but who cares? Space plus quotation hidden dot zip quotation and the name of the file you want outputted. I'm going to do test.png. You can do JPEG. In fact, we will. Uh, PNG just retains transparencies. Enter. One file copied. All right. We've done it in like 30 seconds or maybe a minute. Who knows? Anyways, you right click it, double click it. I mean, it opens as a photo. It's a photo. You right click it. You go to properties. It opens with paint. It says it's a JPEG file. It also says it's 28.1 megs, pretty big, obviously, because of what we've got in there. And if you go down to 7-zip, excuse me, go down to open with, and you select 7-zip, all of a sudden we have a folder called desktop page 440. And inside of that, we have photos, photos that you didn't know were in there. So that's just the goal, is to show you guys how to use the command prompt in Windows 10 to turn a picture and a, and a zip file into one. This, this has been here for a while. I mean, it's nothing new. It's just something that's always intrigued me. I was able to use this in high school. I don't know what other purposes you can use it for. Maybe you just want to hide certain photos. I don't know, but it's fun. If you got any other questions, maybe I can help answer them. Just let me know in the comments. Dance with me one more time.